Cygnus CRS 5 also known as Orbital Sciences CRS Flight 5, was the seventh planned flight of the Orbital Sciences unmanned resupply spacecraft Cygnus and its sixth flight to the International Space Station under the Commercial Resupply Services contract with NASA. The mission launched on October 17, 2016 at 7.45 p.m. Orbital and NASA jointly developed a new space transportation system to provide commercial cargo resupply services to the International Space Station ISS. Under the Commercial Orbital Transportation System COTS program, Orbital designed and built Antares, a medium-class launch vehicle, Cygnus, an advanced maneuvering spacecraft, and a pressurized cargo module which is provided by Orbital's industrial partner Thales Alenia Space. The Cygnus spacecraft for this mission is named the SS Allen Poindexter in honor to astronaut Alan G. Poindexter, a deceased Space Shuttle commander. Poindexter was selected in the 1998 NASA Group G-17 and went into orbit aboard Space Shuttle missions STS-122 and STS-131. History The COTS demonstration mission was successfully conducted in September 2013, and Orbital commenced operational ISS cargo missions under the Commercial Resupply Service program with two missions in 2014. Regrettably, the third operational mission, Orb CRS-3, was not successful due to spectacular Antares failure during launch. The company decided to discontinue the Antares 100 series and accelerate the introduction of a new propulsion system. The Antares system is being upgraded with newly built Rode 181 first stage engines to provide greater payload performance and increased reliability. In late 2014, Orbital contracted United Launch Alliance for an Atlas V launch of Orbo A4 in late 2015 from Cape Canaveral, FL, and with a second Atlas V launch of Cygnus in 2016. The company plans three Cygnus missions in 2016, in the first CRS 6 third CRS 5 and fourth quarters CRS 7 of 2016. The Cygnus 5 and 7 will fly on the new Antares 230 and 6 will fly on second Atlas V in first quarter of 2016. These three missions enable Orbital ATK to fulfill their CRS contracted payload obligation. This particular mission is known as OA-5. Production and integration of Cygnus spacecraft is performed in Dulles, VA. The Cygnus service module is mated with the pressurized cargo module at the launch site, and mission operations are conducted from control centers in Dulles and Houston. Topic spacecraft This was the sixth of ten flights by Orbital ATK under the Commercial Resupply Services contract with NASA. This was the third flight of the enhanced-sized Cygnus PCM. The mission successfully launched on 17 October 2016, 2345 Coordinated Universal Time in keeping with an orbital ATK tradition. This Cygnus spacecraft is named the SS Allen Poindexter after the NASA astronaut who flew aboard the Space Shuttle twice 2008 and 2010. Topic. Manifest. Total cargo mass on ascent: 2,425 kilograms (5,346 pounds). Pressurized cargo with packaging: 2,342 kilograms (5,163 pounds). Science investigations: 498 kilograms (1,098 pounds). Crew supplies: 585 kilograms (1,290 pounds). Vehicle hardware: 1,023 kilograms (2,255 pounds). Spacewalk equipment: 5 kilograms (11 pounds). Computer resources: 56 kilograms (123 pounds). Russian hardware: 42 kilograms (93 pounds). Unpressurized cargo: CubeSats: 83 kilograms (183 pounds). Total cargo on descent destructive 1687 kilograms 3719 pounds Topic Other OA projects NASA had planned the next Cygnus flight OA7 for the 30th of December 2016 
However, in October 2016, it was announced that OA-7 was being delayed until March 2017 and switched from the Antares launch vehicle to a United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket to provide additional cargo up mass for NASA. In 2015, under the NASA CRS-1 contract, Orbital was awarded three extension flights for 2017 and 2018. The OA-8E flight has tentatively been scheduled for 12 June 2017, followed by OA-9E later that year and OA-10E in 2018. Cargo vehicle scheduling is dynamic with the ISS partners. The schedule will be influenced by the first USA manned commercial flights SpaceX, Boeing, to ISS since Space Shuttle retirement in 2011. <laughs> CubeSat release. On 25 November 2016, after leaving the ISS, the spacecraft raised its orbit to 500 km and released four Lima-2 CubeSats for Spire Global. <laughs> 